Today we are going to discuss the Keen and Ken coat of arms. But before we get started, we wanted to let you know that we offer genealogy research service at our website. Please visit us at coadb.com. First coat of arms to discuss is blazoned, Ermine Three Crescents Ghouls, Crest, a Unicorn's Head Azure, Byzanti, Maned Ore, Horned Ore, and Sable. This is for the Ken of Ken family in Somerset, England. Granted in 1561 to Christopher Ken, Esquire of Ken Court in Somerset, son of John Ken of Newland, and County Gloucester, who was son of John Ken, who was son of Robert Ken, who died in 1453. Similar coat of arms, this crest is three crescents interwoven argents for Ken of Langford in Somerset, Edmund Ken of Langford, alive in the year 1623, was son of Edmund Ken of Hutton, who was son of John Ken of Ken, who was son of Robert Ken of Ken. There was also Thomas Ken, alive in the year 1643, a mercer of London, who descended from this family. Next we have Azure, a Talbot pass and oar, on a cheap indented argent, three crosses flory sable, crest, a hind's head, erased sable bizanti. This was for the Keene family of North Cove and Thandestin in County Suffolk, England. It was granted in 1562 to John Keene, son of Robert Keene of Thandestin. It was also born by Whitstead Keene, seen here, who died in 1822 of Richmond in County Surrey and of Hawthorne Hill in Berkshire, a member of Parliament for Wareham, Luttergall, Luttershall, and Montgomery. He was son of Captain Gilbert Keene. Also, Sir Benjamin Keene, born around the year 1697, a member of Parliament for Malden and West Lou, or Lowe. He was ambassador to Madrid, envoy to Lisbon, son of Charles Keene, a mercer, alderman, and mayor of Kings Lynn in County Suffolk. There was also Benjamin Keene, born 1753, of Westo Lodge in County Cambridgeshire, England, a member of Parliament, who was the son of Reverend Edmund Keene, seen here a bishop. Next we have Keene of Starston and Nofork. John Keene of Starston, alive in the year 1601, son of Thomas Keene of Starston, who was son of Thomas Keene. Another for Keene of Ipswich in County Suffolk. Ermine across Flory. There was a Keene of Essex, a knight who were alive in the 14th, I'm sorry, the 15th century. And this was also the arms of Robert Lequen, who fought in the Crusade of 1270 AD. Here we have Ermine across cross batons. Ermine's crest, five arrows, one in pale and four in satire, heads down or headed argent banded ghouls. This belonged to Henry George Keene Esquire, seen here in this photograph, born 1826 an English historian of medieval and modern India, the son of Henry George Keene, born 1781, who was a soldier and civil servant in the East India Company and also a Persian scholar, a churchman, and an academic, the only son of Thomas Keene, who was son of Henry Keene, an English architect, born 1726. Ghouls, a gauntlet and fess, or a chief argent, three stars of the first, were Keen or Kine of Catesley in Roxburgh and Heatherley in Scotland. Wasn't able to find who this belonged to. If you know, please let us know in the comments. There is not a... I was unable to find a location called Catesley in Roxburghshire, Scotland. That could be an error. Keen ghouls across crosslet ermine. Likely very old given the simplicity. Another one for Keen, Ermine, three crescents ghouls, crest and eagle's head coop proper. Keen of Devonshire, England, sable a chevron and grail between three suns and splendor argent. Ghouls, a chevron between six crescents or. Keen of Ireland, I wasn't able to ascertain what the shield of the escutcheon is, so we just left it blank here. But the crest was a martlet or. And several possibilities include Talbot Keene of Dublin, an apothecary 
who died in 1708, Reverend Talbot Keene of Cashel in County Tipperary, who died in 1724, Arthur Keene of Dublin, who died in 1752, Gilbert Keene Esquire, who died in 1764, and John Keene of Dame Street in Dublin, a goldsmith who died in 1809. Similar situation here. We don't know the armature or the shield, but the crest is a griffin's head proper. And if you enjoyed this video, please visit us at coadb.com. Link in the description. Thank you very much.